If you've been wanting to learn how to add your own logos or social media information in your videos in Adobe Premiere Rush, we'll stick around and I'll show you how. Hey everybody, what's going on? Claudio here and welcome to my channel where I share tips and tools to help you tell your story. As I mentioned at the start, I'm going to share with you some tips on how to add your own logos and social media information as lower thirds or even just keep them on throughout your whole video. So without any further ado, let's go ahead and jump right in. I've already got a video loaded into my project. My next step is to import my logo and social media uh, information. So let me tap on the blue plus sign on the lower left corner and then choose media. I have mine in my Creative Cloud folder. You can also import from Dropbox. And now on iOS, you can also import from your files folder. Let me tap on my Creative Cloud folder and let me go find my logos here. And let's go ahead and choose that one there. And then let me locate my social media image here. And let's choose that one. And now that I have both, I'm going to tap on add and then Adobe Premiere Rush is going to bring them in here. So now what I'll do is let me go ahead and kind of increase the size and grab the logos there and then move them towards the top layer now. So there will be my logo there and then there's social media. Now I'm going to actually add that to the next top layer. And for now, let's go ahead and resize the social media one. So let's tap on transform and then choose scale. And I'm going to bring that down and then maybe slide it over to the left. Maybe bring it down to like the corner there. And I may actually size it down just a little bit more. There we go. And then just kind of fine tune it to that lower left corner. Then what I'm going to do is bring that layer towards the front kind of towards the intro of my video and let's see and instead of having that abrupt in and out I'm going to choose transition and then the first cross dissolve there so that way when it comes in it kind of fades in and then fades out now what I'm going to do is address my logo and for that one I actually want that to be in my whole video so I'm going to drag the front and then drag towards the end and it kind of auto adjusts itself to match my clip and then it's really large so what I'm going to do is go back out to transform again resize that bring it down and then I'm going to move that one to the right side here so let's choose the horizontal and then let's adjust the vertical so it's there and if i want to i can make that one kind of fade in and out but i think i'm just going to leave it as is so let's see how it looks like i hit play my social media information fades in and out my logo's there from start to finish really cool and that is how i add my logo and social media information to my videos using adobe premiere rush i hope this video has been helpful and something that you can use in the future as you brand your own content. If you have any questions or comments, please do add it in the comment section below. Don't forget to hit that like button and I would appreciate it if you'd subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so. Don't forget, click on the bell to be notified for future videos. Once again, thank you for watching and as always, be good to one another. Peace. I'm out.